hey guys welcome back to my channel today i will be showing you guys how to make this delicious your malicious open lacha by sister flo chinyere the all nigerian recipe this soup has all the vitamins vitamin cure vitamin whatever <laughs> you can think of okay if you want to know how i prepared this yummy soup just stay tuned and keep watching guys and all my returning subscribers man you guys are the mvips i see all your comments all your shares i appreciate them and to my new subscribers in the house thank you guys so much for tuning in into my channel today and for those that are just clicking for the first time because of the thumbnail of this delicious soup you're highly welcome you can join this family by clicking on the red subscribe button to become a part of this family and to get notified whenever i upload delicious recipes lifestyle vlogs about my family and financial tips Here are the list of ingredients that we'll need for this recipe. We'll need uh, chili pepper. This is for spiciness. And this paprika for additional coloring. This is spinach. It's not actually frozen. I bought them when it was fresh, but I had leftover and I freezed it. This is our seasoning cubes. Onions. I'm making use of the white and red onions. This is our mushrooms if you say it's cute buttons according to sister flo that if you don't eat mushrooms you should let her know in the comment section but well i started eating mushrooms when i left nigeria when i was in nigeria we have this belief that it's poisonous but i'm surprised that it's not that bad it's not bit it's not bitter and it's not sweet mushrooms are just in between it's just like eating a meat that that is not tasty. That's my own, but I don't know for you. But if you feel it's sweet, let me know in the comment section. And this is smoked fish. I have a video of how to smoke your fish over the grill. The link would pop up in the video above. But if you want to use your oven, Stachinier has a detailed video on how to smoke your fish with micro, I know micro, with the oven. I'll put the link in the description box below of this video. And of course, there is no food without salt. There is no Nigerian meal without palm oil. And we're making use of chicken. And finally, our okra, the main ingredient. If you're an evil person, you will know what it means. That means it's like they can't give you a cheap tansy or whatever. You can't wear a cap without a head. I have my chicken in the pot. I'm going to be adding one stock cube. Some salt. And the white onion. I will make use of the red onion later. I'll add some water. Stir this. I usually pressure rice. I usually use cook my chicken in the pressure pot for 10 minutes and it's okay. So I added just little water because the open lacha does not require much water you need it to be very thick for you to be you need it to be very thick for you to be able to lick it without any swallow because often lacha requires little water so that it will be very thick that's why i use little water to steam this chicken then i'll be using the rest to blend my paprika our chicken is ready so we'll have to start making our open lacha I'll be adding some amount of palm oil in the pot, a generous amount because my okra is really, really much. We'll allow it to heat up because I don't need much water in the soup. 
I'll be adding my grounded paprika pepper into the chicken and allow it to boil so that it can the quantity of the water can reduce then we're going to be frying our mushroom for about five minutes frying for over five minutes so we're we'll going to take it out from the oil Okay, I'm cooking this last quantity because this is the season of okra here. We hardly have fresh okra and the fresh one is much much preferable than making use of the frozen one. Although I've tried oven latcha before but with the frozen one and it didn't give me a very good result. for over five minutes because it's really a large quantity and it's still hot but because we want the okra to be crunchy so we'll be adding this chicken and the paprika but we want to add all the water at the same time to be sure of the consistency See that it's still very thick, so I'll just go ahead and put everything. You can see how thick the oven latcha is. Chai, madramia. to be adding putting back our mushroom chili pepper our stock cube and understand Our uh, spinach, Stir this all. Mm 
I don't want my small fish to scatter. That's why I'm putting it at this stage by the side. So I will try and dip it in a bit so that the flavor can go into the soup. So I'm going to cover this and allow it to boil for about 3 to 10 minutes. Well, our soup has been boiling for the past 3 minutes. Oh, now so poto 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 poto. Have you liked this video yet? Have you? As in, after looking at this delicious open latcha with all the beautiful color, the juiciness, and the vitamins, and you haven't liked this video yet? Ah, madre mia. I don't know what else you want me to say, but this soup is more than super, super delicious. At this stage, we just test for salt, and if it's salt, it's okay, then our soup is ready. I will just add a little. Stir it a bit, allow it to boil for 30 seconds, and our soup, it's ready as in the confirmed open latcha you see how thick and yummy it is thank you guys so much for watching this video please if you haven't subscribed to my channel kindly click on the red subscribe button to become a part of this family and i'm going to see you guys in my next video bye bye See you soon.